into a couple of Indians in San Denis. A chief called Rangefall and his son. Yeah, I know the name. I'm real need of help right now. Okay, I'll catch you later then. Yep. All right. Hey, Arthur. You're keeping busy? Trying to. Best you stick to the chores. Leave the real work for the rest of us. I could say the same about you. Don't worry, I'm just playing with you. Some pack must be shy of Joker. Okay. Hiya, Arthur. Look, everything's gonna be all right. I know. You'll be good Ms. now. Bye -bye. What is it? Have you seen Karen? Oh, the O'Driscoll boy? No, I haven't. Firstly, he isn't an O'Driscoll, and secondly, I'm worried. Well, I'm sure he'll turn up. His sort normally do. Okay. Thank you. Everything okay? Arthur, have you seen Kieran around anywhere? Well, come to think of it, no, not for a while. All right, well, I should be getting on. Sure. You awake yet? You were snoring, that's all. Ha! Hey there. What is it? The young Mr. guns Morgan. do this. You Good got this place whipped into finger. shape, all right. I'm trying. Oh, just go away. Hey. Hey. Hardest worker in camp. Someone's got to do it. Well, don't let me disturb you. Sounds good. Hi, Karen. Hi, Arthur. Keeping out of mischief? Yes, unfortunately. All right. I'll leave you to it. Okay, then. You'll work it out, Dutch. You always do. Greetings, my boy. You good? Just can't seem to get a moment's peace. Well, I'll leave you to it. All right, Arthur. Hello, Arthur. There he is. You ever miss Austria? Sometimes, I suppose. Because maybe we'd all be better off if you went there. Now, there's no need to be rude. I'm only joking with you. Ben, I'm not sure I share your sense of humor. Mr. Gentlemen. Morgan. Howdy. Hey, Uncle. Mr. Swanson. Room by the fire here, Mr. Morgan. Susan. Well, that's hardly the best choice of outfit for this heat. Managing to keep everyone in line? I'm doing my best. You just love the power, don't you? Who do you think you're talking to? I'm only kidding around. It wasn't funny ten years ago, and it still isn't now. How you doing, Mrs. Edler? How are you? Been quite a journey since I... Well, since I joined you fellas. Yes. And now you and Dutch have joined high society. My oh, lord above. Yeah, it seems so. I think my days in polite society are over. Well, I just saw Bill Williamson at a party at the San Denise's mayor's house. <laughs> if he can do it, anyone can. Will you get any leads? Yeah, I think so. You know so, Arthur Morgan. Come on, we need to talk. Miss Sadler, will you excuse us? When are you gonna let me come robbing with you, Dutch? My lord, a few more like her, we could take over the whole world. Yeah. A few more like her, there wouldn't be much of a world left. Yes, perhaps. Now, the trolley bus station. I went down there. I took a look at it. I think we can hit it. <laughs> I ain't never robbed in a city before. Yeah, well, you leave the planning to me. You'll ride with me. Always. Is it just you and me? No, we'll need one more, I reckon. I say Lenny. Not Micah. Well, that depends if you want a massacre or a payday. No, I wish that there was something I could do to make the two of you get along better. Well, that's easy. Make them change. Very funny. 
What is that? What the hell have they done to me? Look, there, the tree line. Everybody take cover! O'Driscoll boys are coming!
one I got this. Get these windows covered quickly. John, you take the windows over there. Charles, you take the side doors there. Arthur, you take the windows in the back. Go! That's him! Huh? Gun flame! Is everyone accounted for? Okay? I think so. Except for Karen here. Uh, poor kid. Mr. Swanson, would you take this boy and bury him someplace near, but not too near? Of course. Charles, help me with the body. We need to get this place cleaned up. Mr. Pearson, Miss Grimshaw. Already taking care of it. Come on now, work. Comb O'Driscoll. That man can really hate. So can I, Arthur. So can I. We need to get moving. Away from here. So we should start looking for another camp. You ain't thinking big enough, Arthur. You ain't seeing the vastness of our problems and our opportunities. I'm not sure I get you. You will, son. You will. Meet me near the trolley station. We got work. Shall we? Yep. He saved my life, and I could not save his. Mrs. Adler fought braver than any of us. She is driven by powerful forces I scarcely understand. That's what love has done to her, I guess. <laughs> 